Hello. It's Tip Top Tuesday, and in the United States, it's New Year's Eve. And Happy New Year to everybody. We're going from 2019 to 2020 in the Gregorian um, calendar. Um, I hope everybody has a fabulous year. And the word hope is the key here. I like, someone taught me this years ago that to pick a word for the year, just a word, and then it's your focus, your meditation focus. And this year, my word is hope. I picked it because I've been randomly hearing hope through many sources. So I felt like this was the word. What I, how, and how, did, how does that work? What do I do? What I do is I focus on, oh, somebody's here. Good. I know. I'm in kind of a quiet mode. I've been reading a lot and just kind of uh, taking life in and, and uh, meditating and mostly reading, mostly reading uh, auto, bi memoirs and biographies. And I was reading um, um, Maya Angelou's when she was in Ghana recently, and she t she had um, talked about hope too, but the expression hope springs eternal in the human breast was actually first done by Alexander Pope in, in his uh, work essay. We mostly hear um, hope springs eternal, but it makes more sense if you hear it saying hope springs eternal in the human breast because um, it's part of our heart motion. It's what, what helps us keep going. For me, I have never, I, I, I struggle with the word hope. I don't really like it. I think it's a setup, all these things. It brings out some of my negativity. Nevertheless, it's my word and I'm going to embrace it. So I'm going to encourage everyone to uh, pick their word and for a happier, more insightful year for themselves. But mostly, I want to say Happy New Year, and I hope you guys have the best year ever. See, hope, I use it a lot. Anyway, take care, and uh, Happy New Year.